Hey guys, Mark here. I hope you're all doing well. I had a couple of questions about how to finish a paracord wrap. Well, there are many ways that you can use. Firstly, try to see if you can finish it the same way that you started it. Many wraps can be finished the exact same way that you started one. The second way is to use a specific knot, for example, a foot rope knot. Many times you can use a binding and this is what I'm going to show you in this video. A binding is basically a wrap with a smaller strand which you then cover with a fancy knot such as a Turk's head knot. With that said, let's move on to the tutorial. Here I have a two-stranded ring bolt hitching wrap that I demonstrated in the previous video. It needs a finish to its ends so I'm going to grab a thin piece of rope. It is best to use artificial sinew for binding the ends, but if you don't have it available, you can either use rope or even an inner strand of paracord, since those are quite strong as well. We're going to start by making a constrictor knot over our two ends. Wrap around once. Then go over your first wrap, creating an X. When you come up, go over this first wrap, so the standing end. And then under the X. So we have made a constrictor knot and we have a small part remaining in our standing end, which we will need later on. Now make a few wrapper rounds in order to bind your ends. Let's say a few wraps is enough. The more wraps you do, the more secure your ends will be, but the larger the binding will be, so you will also need to use a larger covering knot. After that, we finish with another constrictor knot. So wrap around. Create an X shape, like we did before. And then finally, go under this X. Like this. And adjust your constrictor knot. And with this, we got a fairly secure binding. Now you can further secure it by simply tying a square knot with both of the ends. And you have a secure binding for the end of your wraps. Finally, cover the binding with a Turk's head knot, in my case the Spanish ring knot. So guys, I hope that this tutorial will come in handy, thank you for joining me and see you next time.